Query check 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 query. Check 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 check. We are live. Ah, abala biwa fabalunji ngabu lijo tu kumi yote cha motorsport. Omanju zivo no moereza. Amanya sigara thate tu. Amazara nzeri ya. Ah, olowale tuzo mukulu dipo. Ngabu tu abal suviza. Mukulu dipo tu mu interview nge koko kubanga ba driver manji ba liwa suviza bingi koko moji jikwe. Ngabu tu abagamba la le driver kubanga jeno asigara generali. Kubanga olowa ne Omugenzi wedi ya fana hila tuchamu samu HTV wangaji na yari. Wangaji ya bavuzi memo kaba food day. Na hila tuchamu samu pole pole, mohanji. Mwana tuwa samu uchi HTV. Uluwa lero ndi uwa mkulu dipunga wa mula ba. E, zimu kumashini zari muna muruja. Elanga motorsport man. Ndi uwa president wa fagina tufuge miyake na ya katambu za kwa mwaka gumo. Kalichiteke za tulimu mwaka gwa kubili. Neo mwaka gwa kubili kwe toge dako. Banji wa complaining. Waga mba gulimu enkenyera, gulimu empulungu se. Zebaga mazita na ukutela. Dara kusaidia wa dweva neva mungu. Bako la nabo. We wawo katu ingire muundangu ya mula wa makage. Atu uli lensonga. Che chiganye. Mubintu. Awa mubi wa complaining ako. Ye. Agena kuteka u solution ichi. Bichibi ya subi lukole la wala le dweva. Betu subi la wali nukufuna mchitu chino. Kuwanga wa biggest shareholders. Bate kamu sente zawe. Bate kamu obude wawe. Neva le le dweva. Oba ba kompiti tababa teka musente. Ngawe na kugamba basu za bantu banji. Interview ya fea guwa ya sempija na jibu. Ya tugamba ya sente entono nyo. Omulabi warale za kuhusa. Emtuwa lukumi. Ategwe tu batu sanzeyo. We wawo guwa omulabi. Eda ayagala motosport. Echitono nyo. Echitegezo kuhusa emtuwa la atano. Ato umutu wabaye vugide motoka. Jibalide emtuwa longa asa mweza mafuta. Haino kusula, haino kulia. We wawo tu wa muzei dipu. FMU president agena tufuge miyake ina ya katambu za kugumu katu ingi tumubuzi atubuli nsonga hello Mr. Dipu hi yes Mr. how are 32. you I'm okay how, how are you, you sir? I'm very fine okay. most welcome guys chimeza mm. cha motorsport exactly the number one motorsport show in Uganda and we are here to bring to our viewers about motorsport you're most right welcome. down to the roots you're most welcome okay thank we you we were supposed to have had this interview during the campaigns but i think all of us got busy but we are here today okay nice to meet you guys thank you uh as i told you our dear viewers we are at uh, mr dipulu palerias residence uh should i disclose our location uh, yeah, we are in Muyenga. <laughs> you know, we may be having such threats. Okay, we are at Muyenga, and we are at Mr. Dipu's residence. As I told you, our viewers, when I was introducing this interview, today is the 9th of February, 2020. Today, we have come to Mr. Dipu's residence, and he's the current FMU president of Uganda. We so much wished him to rule. And so much we expect a lot from him. However, there are still some hiccups from both the navigators, drivers, and the spectators. However, this time around, we have come to hear from the horse's mouth. You know, we have been anticipating, we have been talking rubbish, we have been, but today we want to interview him so that he tells us what he has, what is preparing for FMU as a club, what is preparing for the spectators, so much more. Yes, Mr. Dipu. Uh, we understand so much. We understand so much. We are one of your four campaigners. Thank you. For Thank you the much. term of 2019 20. to 2023. 20, Those are the four years. No, 20 to 24. I mean 20 to 24. Those are the four years. Because in 2019 we were in the campaign. So you started your term in 2020 20. to 2024. Yes. And uh, in your manifesto, you promised heaven and earth. And uh, here we are again. We didn't get time to come and interview you, but the calls we got from the, your lovers, 
your supporters, they said you are the best for this position. And yes, we gave a shoulder to that. Because first, you are a rally driver. For me, I, I say legend is always a legend. I call you a rally driver, although you are longer driving, I call you a rally driver. Because even if it's a singer, they go for consultation. That means they are still active in the system until death does us apart, right? Uh, we have done several interviews with some of the drivers in Uganda, but there are a bit of complaints. We understand the drivers. To me, I don't know to the system. The drivers are the biggest shareholders they yeah, are in this sport because they give the biggest percentage to the sport and it's, if it wasn't for them the sport wouldn't be here because I've seen um, in Rwanda they went on a strike the drivers the sport was called on a hold you know when we were going for the Mbarara rally there was a, a mingo it was supposed to be on Friday they told us it was going to be there on Thursday. There was miscommunication until then we, we, we asked ourselves in the FMU charter, they say they give they give the organizers or the club that is going to organize three months down to organize, to prepare for any event any, any event that is going to be there. So what did you feel doing that workers? <coughs> what do you want to know more about the Mbarara rally? First, I want to know about the Marara because it brought most of us down. And here we are, we are going for the Ginger Rally. As I know, the current vice president resigned. The second in command, deputy vice president, uh, Jeff Kawagamba, also resigned. So, do you expect such workers again? Let me start with the Marara Rally, then we come forward to the resignation yes, issues. Yes. Um, First of all, Bala Musiza, all, all your viewers on uh, the Chinese Cha Motorsports Show. I also want to tell you that I am a driver, I was a driver, exactly. and my drivers will always put my number one priority exactly. in any decision I take. Exactly. Let's talk about Mbarara. The FMU in the ex home, it was agreed 12 weeks before the event. Exactly. By now, collect a documentation mm -hmm. so that we start getting all the permissions. Yeah, exactly. Mbarara did not bring their documentation in time. But I said, I think around 5th or 6th of December. Mm -hmm. The dates Mbarara asked for exactly. was Thursday, Friday, Saturday. There was no Sunday. There was no Sunday. 20th to 22nd. Exactly. When the Ministry of Works people went around the section, around the route inspection, exactly. They came back, I think you might have seen that report floating around on social media. We saw, we were receiving I, I saw that somebody posted it somewhere. Mm -hmm. And in that report, they said we are giving you the date of 20th or 22nd, which exactly. would have been Thursday, Friday, Friday Saturday. Saturday. Exactly. Thursday was meant to be scrutiny, yes. Friday and Saturday, the event. Mm -hmm. Then his excellency came end of the year in his uh, speech and he said to Gendakuchi we're going to open up the economy. Exactly. When they said that the dynamics changed. Now Mbarara said we want 23rd. But the report from Ministry of Works was already out there for everyone to see. And it was the dates that they asked us to ask for from Ministry of Works. You know they have to come to the Federation and Federation on their behalf. When we went to Ministry of Works, we told them these are the dates. Sporting Commission sat down with, with Mbarara. First three meetings, they called them, they refused to come. Exactly. On the fourth meeting, that is the Tuesday before the rally, mm. they sat and they agreed to Gendakuchusa supplementary regs and the itinerary to be, to be within those three days, 20th, Friday, and Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Mm. Okay? And Sporting told them, these are the dates according to the report you are getting. Mm. Unless they change otherwise, but this, for now you'll have to change your itinerary based mm. on this. No, to ask, to cut you short. Mm. Uh, as far as I know, the, com the information we are getting on ground, you know people call us. Mm. When we may not get, because I may b not be active by then on uh, WhatsApp or in social media page that we get information from. Mm. But as far as I know, they said, the scaffold came from on ground. 
the Marana, I hear this Western Moto Club and Marana Moto Club. You also don't know. Then there was also a tale that you had, you as FMU, you had uh, gave all the powers of the circuit to Rakataka. No. You see, when we give an event to a club, mm. it is them who deal with the people who they are going to give their circuits to. Mm. Not us. Mm. For us, we give you number 32, our event, we say you are running this event. Obaoleta Balam, Obaoleta Rakataka, or Chupa Chupa, that is your choice. So, no, no, it is not us. But for us, the information we are getting, mm. uh, Rakataka was not... I, to, I, I, it's a hearsay. I, I don't start and I don't confirm on that. But they were getting... Rakataka had bought the event of the circuit. And as far as I know, he's a, he, we, all, we are all businessmen. Mm. So to him, because he had the, the president had come on board and was opening up economy, to him it was favorable to be a Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Mm. And to our side it was also favorable. Mm. Because uh, at first the internet was Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Saturday. So well, if the president was opening the economy, even if it were you and you are the biggest sponsor yes. and you are them, at least you would opt for the Friday, Saturday, Sunday, when, when people You are. see, you opt for it when you also have the date given to you. Mm. The speed lift, mm. if the speed lift says Thursday, Friday, Saturday, mm. can you... Uh, As FMU, can we give you a speed lift? It is, if it's, it's not us. the mess of works that gives. that gives us. Mm. So if they say we are going to give you a speed lift for Thursday, Friday, Saturday, mm. then those are the only days we can also offer you. Okay, Mr. Dipu, thank you for enlightening on that but issue. But I'm still coming on mm. to this issue. Mm. Okay, now, Tuesday, Sporting Commission and Mbarara Motor Club, which was led by the LCOC mm. and uh, event manager, Ernest, exactly. agreed with the Sporting Commission that by 6 o'clock we are mm. going to give you the what? The, um, the, 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 the revised itinerary and mm. supplementary regs. Mm. Six o'clock, they didn't do it. Next mm. day on Wednesday, Sporting Commission waited up to two o'clock. At mm. around two o'clock, they wrote to us, management, mm. that we do not recommend these people to get an event permit mm. because they are not complying mm. to these things which have been asked by the Ministry of Works people. Yes. Remember, mm. there was a place called Kakoba. Mm. They said you have to put either speed humps to slow down the cars because you're going through people's compounds. I know. There was a... Uh, they were they had recommended many 55 marshals safety marshals mm. and these people were only taking 20 safety marshals i get it in seven sections that is mm. three safety marshals per section i get it how can three people marshal all these funds but all these fantastic funds numbers we have that is impossible okay there because was, uh, and and surprising this time even we came in low numbers because people had just taken uh, students to schools the economy had just but opened, still, people are still investing so much in business. Safety of fans, safety mm. of competitors mm. is our responsibility. All of us. It's a collective responsibility. Exactly. Okay? Mm. Now, Wednesday, when they said we are not recommending, mm. still on Thursday I called a management meeting. Exactly. I called Mbarara Motor Club, mm. I called Sporting Commission, mm. I called Ministry of Works mm. and Management. Mm. Nebabu is the first question I asked Minister of Works, gentlemen. Mm. Boss, we are here calling this meeting. Can you tell us which dates we are looking at? Because what am I discussing if I don't know the dates? Young Amber, mm. the report you got from us, mm. and the dates you are going with... That is the Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Okay? Mm. So I told these people of Mbarara, have you heard that we are discussing these dates? Now, there are issues, Sporting Commission, for you, you are saying we shouldn't give them the what? The permit. Permit. Speed lift. But this event is number one on our what? Calendar. Mm. And we must try and see that this event happens. Mm. Now, you, Mbarara, let us meet halfway. We come, you also come, and we find a solution which is harmonized by f and okay for everybody. Mm. And Ministry of Works here is saying that you people have 20 to 22nd. Mm. They had said no sprint, but I've seen you putting a letter on social media from the director of medical services that saying that sprint. you can have, uh, what? Uh, you can, you're allowed to have fans and circuit, I don't know, whatever. Mm. So you can have a circuit, but put it between those three days. That's we are not even right. stopping you on that mm. one. Okay, sir, we are going to respond to you by 3.45, that was the time. 3.45, no response. For something I called up the DVP because he was also part of that event mm. okay in the background 
I called up Jeff and I asked him, Jeff, why have these people not responded with these details? Mm. Even me, I don't know. I'm going to talk to them. Nothing. So I called up Ernest and I asked him, Ernest, you are supposed to respond by 345. Mm. No, no, we need more time. I said, write to us because we have stakeholders. Some are already in Barara, the drivers, but also my fans are my stakeholders. Exactly. Okay, the fans are number three stakeholders in this sport. And you cannot make them reach Mbarara. That time there was a fuel shortage at 7K a liter of fuel. Yes. And somebody drives to Mbarara, then you tell him no event. No that event. would be very unfair. No. We need to know that if you're not going to comply, we have to take a decision. Mm. Besides, we have not even got the speed lift in our hands. So it is Thursday today. The event is supposed to be started today or tomorrow. No speed lift. What are we doing here? 10 o'clock, 8 o'clock, 9 o'clock, 10 o'clock, no response. Mm. We are calling their numbers, they are not picking our phone calls. That is when we sat as m and we decided that if we don't have a recommendation to give them an event permit from Sporting Commission, mm. if we have not got the speed lift in our hands, mm. so they even should be called off. let's call it off. Mm. And it was a very painful decision mm -hmm. because for me, my drivers were hurting me more than anything else. Exactly. Okay? But it is the, the club which was there. defying, and they were trying to be, you know, big-headed, and they were trying to show us that they have clout mm. or mm. powers. Mm. And that decision was a very sad one we took, and it was not one we all, any of us wanted to take. Exactly. Friday morning, I switch on my phone like this. My phone is full of WhatsApps. And audios, people are bashing us, people are saying, Dipu this, Simani Baindi, what, what, what? And I was <laughs> like, my God, what is going on? I will also come to that. Now, let me tell saying. you, mm. Ponziano calls me and many other drivers call mm. me. Mr. President, can we get this, these people to write you a letter that they are mm. changing these things? I said, even now, write to me. Mm. If we can save this event, let us save this mm. event. He told me, I'm, within one hour, they are going to write to you. Mm. One hour passed. By now, I got a phone call from Minister of Works. Mm. Mr. President, your speed, li speed lift is ready. Mm. First thing I asked him, what is the date on that speed lift? 21st to 23rd. That's the Thursday, Friday, Saturday. No, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Mm. I said, you are mis telling us that the date you're giving us is Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Now mm. I'm seeing Sunday there. Mm. Okay? If you had known you were going to give Sunday, we, did, we shouldn't have even had a problem with Marara. All exactly. these discussions, meetings, nothing was necessary. Mm. But you are the one we depend on what you told us. Exactly. Okay? Mm. So I called another management meeting. Mm. In the second meeting now, I called Sporting Commission. I called the, the chairman of stewards, Mr. Bob Biabashaija. Mm. I told, and Barara. I told... Sporting Commission, what do you pe want these people to comply? Tell us now. Mm. Because the event must happen. Exactly. Okay? And I don't see why we are stopping this event when they have got the dates they, are, they, have they been looking it. for. Mm. And I did this not because of the club. The club was looking at 10, 10k entry fee for exactly. their super special. Mm. For me, I did it for my drivers because they invested money and it would be wrong for them to waste that money. Mm. Now, when we called the meeting, Sporting Commission said the recommendations are 55 safety marshals. Mm. I told Barrera, you are asking for 20 safety marshals. You cannot on seven sections. You cannot and, handle. And to Gendakuleta police, we are going to bring <laughs> army. I said, but can they cut a seatbelt of a rally car? No. Can they switch on an extinguisher when a car catches fire? No, because these ones already trained these for that. These are trained for that. Okay? Exactly. I am now telling you, I'm not going to ask you to go with 55 because every club is struggling. Can you go with 30? Okay. Well, it's a problem, but I said, please go with the 30. Mm. Okay? We agreed. Kakoba. What is your second problem, Sporting Commission? That place called Kakoba, we told them to put humps. I don't know what, what. Can you put the humps? Can they, uh, will they put the humps? I told the chairman of stewards that Bob, this event at this time is yours. Exactly. Once the entries close, the stewards are the ones who take over the event, not even FMU. Exactly. This is your event. Can you make sure that they implement what Sporting Commission is asking you to ask them to implement? Exactly. They want humps in Kakoba, they want 30 marshals. You make sure that all these things are done. I put in place. And the event permit is here. Mm. 
I'm giving it to you. You get the rally started. It was unfortunate, but if the club had known that they were going to lobby mm. for Sunday, mm. they should have told us. No, what I know as far as I've heard you, right, the club also didn't know. Because the, the president knew. came. No, the president came in because we all need to know that the president no, no, was no, not but asking Minister open. of Works for 23rd mm. was they, they went behind. So they knew before they got yeah, in. That's they why they were refusing to oh, change. But they should have told mm. that, Mr. President, we know we are getting 23rd. Then I would have said, oh, what are we discussing? Exactly. Can you make sure this is sorted out, this is sorted out? This is... Have you had any issues in 2021 with any club where we had to sit with them one day before the No, event? we did. Why this one? No, okay. I, I, at least our viewers have had clear information for the mo from the horse's mouth about the embryo ride. We are so much uh, uh, satiric about the information we are getting from grounds. Most people are putting it on Wakataka. We had bought the event. We had uh, even went ahead to divide the Mbarala into two. We had the Western Club, then the Mbarala Club. They are fighting about money issues. We all need to know that Mbarala had only one club. Anyway, to live about the Mbarala we are coming back to our drivers, the biggest shareholders. Uh, the last interviews I've done, the last interviews. I saw with the, for Najib, yeah, the one you did. Yeah, the one I did. With, uh, I, I also did uh, the one with, um, with the Chitaka, but we have not yet uploaded. Actually, I did the one with Chitaka, Arthur Bleak, and uh, this uh, Happy. I, I mean, uh, the urban, the navigator of uh, Samuel Boete. Okay. Uh, however, they are having a common point. They say they are the biggest shareholders. I mean the stakeholders. They may not be shared, but the stakeholders. They are. They I, I understand you're also a driver. Yes. They invest so much in the sport they because do. they love it. They do. And uh, some are saying even family members were nourishing, they are pushing them away withering them away from the sport but because because of the love of the sport they're investing so much because for the, a, 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 the list a driver can put the one we know that is starting the list may be around five million for me mm. i was once a driver mm. i i never came into the sport and i started off with a big machine i climbed my way slowly i started with a starlet i went to a datsun 710 i went to a sylvia then I went to a 240 RS, then I went to a Pulsar, I went to a Mitsubishi Galant, and then I went to a Celica, then I came to uh, Evo 4, okay? Mm. I never got it easy. So I know what my drivers behind there are struggling and, and seeing. That's what they are complaining about. And for me, my concern in this mm. sport, as much as all my drivers are my drivers, mm. the behind drivers are my mm. concern more. Exactly. Okay, that's because these poor guys, despite you know, driving inferior cars. Exactly. Whatever they invest, whether they invest two million, they have tried to drive and make numbers. Exactly. Why do we make their lives what? Difficult. That's why I want to come to my question. I understand for the past years, we have been getting sponsors mm. for most especially the circuits. Mm. And when we look down, for us who know business, a lot comes out from the circuit. Because I understand if we know it is SM, See, the Southern Motor Club are uh, organizing. The Southern Motor Club has drivers in it. Let them come up, with, they will get around five drivers or seven. They invest in the circuit, or they invest in uh, uh, advertising, uh, putting up the marshals in the circuit, so that the little they get from the gate collections, they divide them among themselves. Can that happen for the now, motorsport, for the love of the For me, mm. in our constitution of FMU, mm. There is a provision for driver's welfare club. Exactly. Katiolaba, when somebody falls down a border border or gets an accident or falls sick, mm. we have a very nice lady called Maggie Mfaliso, hey, Rose Rose Form. Yes. She goes out and starts uh, collecting. collecting. Mm. Uh, we don't want to reach that extent of mm. collecting. We are better than that. Mm. Yeah, uh, uh, that's what this I'm is what I'm trying to tell mm. you. We are better than that. Mm. Now, I have always preached... Mm. That if my drivers can unite, mm. they are the most strongest force there is in FMU. Mm. Kubanga, if all, in my days, all of us drivers were one. Exactly. There was no color, there was no religion, there was nothing. We were one. Mm. When we decide this rally, we take to Kuvuga, mm. period. Exactly. But we don't have that anymore. Now, helping drivers, mm. 
mm -hmm. eh, is a very good thing. But they need to unite. They need to create a body yeah. like they had a uh, Uganda Rally Drivers Association. You remember UMRDC? They, they, they even have they have even a WhatsApp group actually in the I mean this of us changing WhatsApp groups. Some of us started we had rally front I know it's still standing but it is limited on numbers. The moment one goes away somebody comes someone in. So but for driver are, drivers mm. it is very important that they unite. Mm. Right now I was very shocked when I came to FMU and I'm seeing drivers Clicks. And that's why e one, one is to in cut, Panomera, cut on one that. is. Uh, the same work has happened to the Motorcycle Federation. That's why Orlando came to a decision. He made his. True. But then the FMU remained with this. But I remember in most cases when we were going for riding, more especially these uh, nearby circuits, or Galuga. Uh, the likes of uh, Busika, likes of Mukono, we used to have uh, two events. Mm -hmm. When motorcycles come in, then we shall have the riding in the evening mm -hmm. on the mm -hmm. same day. But I'm, I'm no longer seeing the, the hype and vibe we used to have. Okay. Um, because these people divided, and I'm seeing it, it might happen the same. No. In the uh, one thing we have in, uh, to motorsport. One thing we have to realize eh? mm -hmm. with Busika issues, mm -hmm. they had their own reasons. Exactly. For me, I was voted in on Saturday, mm. and on Monday I also read in a newspaper that they had the that they have asked for secession. Exactly. Okay? And they were there in the elections mm. voting, so I was also just as surprised. But mm. I called them almost six meetings. Sit down mm. with us. Whatever your problems, it is not us. It's the previous administration. Exactly. For me, I'm here to clean up and to make sure that these things don't happen again. Do we have? Uh, uh, do we hope for a joint uh, yeah, among us uh, uh, all along the, inter uh, the meetings we have had? Do you hope to have a joint? You know, I, I can't talk. Force between uh, Abusika and the FME once again. You know, it is a wish for all of us. Mm -hmm. All of us wish for that. But at the end of the day, we have reached out to them many times, many, many times. They even, NCS called us, exactly. they sat with us, mm -hmm. and they told them on clearly that you people, what you're doing is wrong, you don't have any clubs on your side, clubs are with FMU, and we are not, we cannot be dealing with individuals. Exactly. Okay? You need to go back to FMU and sit down with them and tell them your issues. Okay. Now, I know their issues are genuine. Even my driver's issues are genuine. Mm. But these are things not caused by us. It, mm. Okay. Not by my administration. Mm. A lot of these problems we have in between the drivers not connecting with each That's other. That's why in, in my, when I was being in my interview, we expected a lot. No, it you see a lot is being expected from because you are once a rally Yes, driver. but one thing you have to realize, eh? first we need to remove this, this, these clicks. Mm. And it is us who have created these clicks. Because if I come and support you, and people, other drivers see that you are very close to me, Exactly. Eh? president. For us, mm. we cannot mix with that one. You understand? But to me, all drivers are mine. Then it brings me back. Because if you say all drivers are yours, I understand uh, DVP, Deputy Vice President, uh, Jeff, Kawa, Jeff Kawagambe had his own drivers, and they are drivers who listen to him. Yeah, the uh, reason I also say Kawatuka, Vice President, also had drivers that listen to him. But that's Currently, wrong. they resigned. But you see, we'll what come to that mm. later. But for drivers listening to particular officials, mm. it is wrong. Okay? But for it me, is, it if is, I saw is. my driver who drives a starlet mm. suffering, mm. okay, mm. I would like to know his problem more than the person who is in front driving a golf polo. Exactly. Or he have a innocent, he can use his 50, so 100 go, million, mm. but this poor guy who is using his 5 million mm. is the one I'm more concerned about. And that's why I'm telling you, I'm, 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 why in, should fear, we have I'm in fear for the sport. Because we are, we are one year down since you came to office. But oh. you see, I found two years of COVID. Exactly. I, I, I did not ask for it. I come in February, March, there is COVID. They even call me the COVID president, I hear. <laughs> okay? <laughs> so, these are things, you know, it, it's, it's some, it wasn't within our control. Mm. These are things that came. But despite mm. all those challenges we found, Exactly. We found 
a lot of rot in the system. Okay? I understand. And the rot we are talking about wasn't rot that you could take two panadols and say the headache will go. Mm -hmm. Now it was time for us to find out for, what for is me, bringing for, that for headache. To call my president, the former president, the business alligator, no. because he did, and uh, he did, uh, I know he did the best for the sport. I know we are going so much in business, but when he decided on something, I swear it happened. And uh, I want to deceive to you, and I want uh, talk about it, I want to backbite you, but no. some say you are ruling, but under, I think you may be ruling under someone, not making decisions, no. and as yourself, as Dipu, you stand up and you say, uh, Rakataka have said this must happen. Uh, no, 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 no. Say Rakataka, this has. Uh, no. We may fear someone that, saying no. you may be ruling under someone. No, because I decisions. don't. Because some of the decisions you are seeing lately, mm. eh, these are not decisions taken by. Mm. Would Senka Tuka tell me to take a decision to to present him in the AGM? No. So it means it was your decision. Okay, you people need to realize one thing. Mm. When I rallied, I rallied alone. Exactly. When I came for this presidential campaign, it was I came. You, you came alone. I did not come with anybody or exactly. anybody's ticket, as in you know, backed by anybody. Exactly. My electorate backed me, exactly. but they liked my manifesto. My That's manifesto. Why I told you, your manifesto gave us. A the lot manifesto of hope. was talking about a cleanup. Now let's mm. talk about the challenges we have faced. Mm. Okay, I come on board. And you have small, small chiefdoms in the sport. And they still exist. We have dismantled most of them. So they're, they're, they're probably because, very few. Because they still exist. When you had just come to office, we had, I don't know whether it's true, that Rajiv uh, about the Central Motor Club. Even I found out later. You know? Okay. But since you are the president of FMU and you see, Rajiv where, was actually your where, son, where we need to <laughs> how could he do a business behind your back? Because I know you have uh, you had the mandate to endorse when I, was by I was not to that deal was done before I came on board. Remember that. In the elections it mm. was not uh, Rajab and his group which came for the as delegates. If you mm. looked at it it was Rajiv and his team that came as what? Delegates. Yeah. That deal was done during Dusman's time. And 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 as far as I know, because the the club sends the Central Motor Club sends people who are going to vote you. Yes. The uh, Umbra Motor Club will send. Uh, Southern Motor Club will send. They send five five delegates. Five, five delegates. Yes. Somewhere saying Rajiv did that in favor of you because but if it was you, towards the election. But no, but for us, will you five had, votes? You had vote, already our votes. What I'm already. saying, will five votes decide? My, my, Even my a vote campaign, can decide. It can. can. It can. But a, a single vote can you need decide. to realize that mm. our numbers were almost 35. I know, because by the time we went for... Even if you took out those five votes, we still had 30. Exactly. That's my point. Mm. It wasn't just on one club. It was many clubs that supported us. That's why I was... I, but people I, I, connecting dots between me and my son, mm. I think is wrong. Then you also connect dots between Kisitu and his sons who are riding. Just saying. Mm. Okay, because if his kids win today, will you say the same thing that Kisitu, because they are your kids and your DVP motorcycling, they won? <laughs> Let's put those dots aside. If they are competitive on ground, that's why what I'm I saying. Now, for me, he's my son. I can't mm. deny that. Exactly. I cannot deny that. But mm. the rules apply to, bo to all everyone people. equally. Exactly. Okay, I'll come to something and I'll tell you something. When Hoima rally happened, I was in Nairobi. I'd gone to see my granddaughter. Yes. And when I was in Nairobi, the marshals called me and said, you most folk don't want to use us because we voted against them. Okay? When we suspended them. Mm. I told the the Africa uh, Kwetu. Africa Kwetu. But African Kwetu, is, uh, actually, we shall also come to that. Yeah. I, I, I've seen that on uh, social media. Mm. Africa Kwetu has been organized again. <laughs> is it uh, still under... Individuals all this time around is under a We will let's get there. Okay. Okay. You have many questions. I have and many let's questions take uh, one at a time. <laughs> let's talk about what I was mm -hmm. talking about. Um, we looked at this issue of marshals, they didn't want to use Umsma or Uma. Exactly. They said both of you voted against, against us. Yeah. And they also claimed they didn't have money to pay for marshals. Mm. As FMU I cleared and told the treasurer, 
send 15 marshals, safety marshals, pay for them, yeah. and pay for 10 time marshals, and the ambulance put fuel, yeah. and send it to Hoima. Yeah. If they use them, good. If they don't, good. It's their choice, but they will be there. Exactly. Okay? We don't want people to think that we have Fitina with you, Mospok. That's yeah. my club. I'm 001 member. I'm the founder yeah. member yeah. of you, Mospok. Yeah. Now, when they went there, these people said, we are not using you. Bale Seba Chuba. Mm. Okay? Now, who they brought, I don't know. Me, I told the president who called me that, Mr. President, these people are not using us. I said, be there. And if they don't want to use you and anything goes wrong, it is okay. But you, we have to show that we are supporting this event. Mm -hmm. Now, when this incident of Rajivs happened, Exactly. Okay? Yeah. See, money, there was a penalty of 500,000 shillings. In my 15 years of rallying, I've never seen a penalty, cash penalty. It is either a time penalty or exclusion. Mm. There is no cash penalty. Where they got that from, I don't know. But I've also seen this. When I came back, mm. I asked one of the stewards who was with me in the ex -com, that you people, this is an embarrassment. How did you charge that boy 500,000 shillings? Eh? And his bonnet was open, and whatever. If he has broken a rule, then he has to be treated like everybody else. He has to, he had to get a penalty of time. Can we have a review? I'm the one who pushed for that review. Mm. Okay, I asked them, can we have a review? You as a person has ever participated? I said, I if, and, and I said, if he has won that event in a wrong way, then revoke his win. But you must have... The, you know, you must fairness. be fairness and the guts to do the right thing. Exactly. You understand? And yes. they called a review. I was not any part of it. I was away from it totally. I didn't want to know. Mm. And I knew that, you know, they will look into all these matters again. Exactly. Whatever decision they came out with now was their own what? Decision. Yes. How the, the COC, Mr. Katende Mukibi, justified that mm. money that he picked from the competitor, I don't know. Okay, but that was them who decided. But this is to show you that there is no favorism in this sport. You understand? There is no favorism. I mean, I'll give you an example. La uh, 2020, there was an incident in Jinja where two of my competitors fought with each other. You must have heard about it. Mosa and Wakataka. I was. I had given instructions that they be disciplined and removed from the event. Mm. Mm. Now, if you say that Ponziano is <laughs> running me or controlling me, no, he's a very no, good friend say, of mine. But son, I didn't say no, Ponziano, people are saying, question. but and, and you see, that's what they think. Mm -hmm. Me and Ponziano go back to the 90s. Because we rally, we together, rally together. Okay? And mm -hmm. we are very good friends. We are like brothers. Uh, that's why. But mm -hmm. where something is wrong, he tells me. And where something is wrong, I see on him, I tell him. Exactly. But there is no saying that, Pons, you go ahead and do this. I'll, so I'll protect oh, you. No. Okay. Okay, uh, I also want to ask on something. Mm, we understand FMU gets funding from the likes of Shell, from the likes of sponsors or hotels that come in mm. to inject in money on anything. But I, I don't know whether we have the right to know on the accountability, but there are things, me as a layman, a supporter, as someone who has ever, because I've ever navigated, someone who likes the sport, and someone who is now anchoring on the sport. Because I understand, if a uh, shell comes up, because I've, I've seen on Shelley's invoices and PTAs where it comes up on media and sales, it has invested in the um, part of, of Africa, around 100 million, not 200. I, uh, where do drivers earn? Like because I said, in most cases, you hear you have given him up a coupon of 20 liters or 10 liters of fuel. If you are giving 10 liters and uh, around 30 drivers have participated, for 10 me, liters of fuel, I, that is less. Gentlemen, I have not done a pal yet, mm. so these questions, do, I don't think I'm the one who should be answering for you. Mm. Because my first pal, God willing, if it happens, it's going to be this mm. one here. In, uh, okay, in, in May. May. All right? So I can tell you about my pal. I cannot tell you about previous Okay, powers. I want to ask you then. Another thing I want to ask uh, is about the resignations. So far, I've gotten two. Actually, three. Two, two, and, two one and one suspension. suspension. 
And I understand, I've worked with these people. They are big gap mm -hmm. in the FMU. Uh, Ernest has been up here. I understand, uh, actually, Ernest is a close friend. Uh, Jeff Kawagami is also a close friend. They are the people we devoted for the street. Mm. Uh, we understand we even wanted to go under FMU, but you know, the street is still in loopholes. They are still and, disorganized. And we are still so much disorganized. Then for Kawagami, I've not been, so, I mean, for Sekar, I've not been so much connected, but as far as uh, the things I've heard of him, I, I, don't you think you'll miss these people, the two people? No, we will miss them, but one thing we have to realize, mm. the sport is bigger than all of us. Exactly. Even Dipu today, if he goes, mm. the sport continues. Exactly. Are you going to tell me that without Dipu there is no sport, without some of these people who got suspended there is no sport? Exactly. The sport wins. The sport is bigger than all of us. This is one thing we have to make very clear. Mm. Dipu came in, I told you in my manifesto my job was to see that everything is cleaned up and put in place. Exactly. I came for one term. Exactly. Okay? My first year was observing what is going on. All right? Where are we going wrong? That COVID period gave me a lot of time to look at things. Okay? Then came that event, which FMU did not sanction, but a whole vice president of FMU was there in the event as a sponsor, as a competitor, even, as an organizer. Even audio audios that went around. Ah, let when, me finish. Mm. A whole vice president, okay? Mm. And, uh, and a whole XCOM as here told you, we are not blessing this event. Mm. Temugenda, even a letter came out one day before that event to all the clubs. Hey, but Bagenze with uh, Jeff and also But there are, some, there are some audios came out that, that showed that African Pet was not under FMU. This was, One thing you this need was to realize. An event as for us, we wake up in the morning, we organize a charity drive. No, you can't. Because if it falls under our jurisdiction and mm. under our disciplines, mm. then there is no way you can what do that event. Because the event, if you look at it, if today you decide to go with a group of people to Kidepo, exactly. and you say we are going to pass Masindi one night, second night we shall sleep in Gulu, Third night we sleep in Kitkum, then fourth night we reach uh, Kidepo. Mm -hmm. Now, even if you don't sleep in Masindi, Gulu, and you go direct to Kidepo, mm -hmm. is there a penalty? No. It is a family thing, it's you family and your thing. friends, that is a different thing. This event had stewards, had COC, had a, ro had a root event um, manager, Simani root designer. It also involved it, funds. It pay. involved uh, tracking. Mm. Award classification, okay? Mm. It was an event event. But it I was not a uh, company that says tomorrow pay pay five hundred K and I'm offering a night three nights and four days mm. in Machison. And you don't reach the car that's spoiled on the road, nobody's penalizing you for that. Exactly. You understand? But this was an event and if I show you article nine point eight point three Okay, of it is of the FMU constitution. It is very clear that this event falls under, if you read this for your listeners or viewers, it is all here. What you look at that? Yes, our viewers are uh, article of 9.83 says touring, vintage, and road safety committee composition. One delegate, one delegate from each vintage. Then we also have members must meet the following minimum uh, qualifications, must be with proven knowledge of procedures, must meet criteria as laid down in Article 7.2, um, the person nominated by Ministry of Tourism of Works um, and Transport and the Ghana Police Force will meet criteria. As I've told, it has clauses in it, and but it when is... When you look uh, at it here, mm, what does it as you, Permission has to be given by who? Uh, one, uh, let me see. Uh, one of the decades from each vintage touring, and then uh, the committee shall meet at least one month. The person nominated by the ministry, I'm not seeing where the permission should be given. Let me show you. It is functions. They have to run the various touring and vintage shows and other events in consultation with clubs strictly following the sporting calendar. Soma? Sporting exactly, calendar. Exactly, I've seen it. Okay. Strictly following the sporting calendar as approved by approves? FMU under the president. Okay, not under the president, the whole XCOM sits mm. down and approves. 
Now this event was not on our calendar. But audios that went saturated showed that African Kwetu, that's why some of us went low on it. African Kwetu was not a mandate of FMU. It is as, as for, because for us we are doing street cars. But you're but not affiliated to FMU. We are affiliated to FMU. That's why most people, because when street racers came in, they wanted to register under FMU. And uh, Jeff Kabagambe and other people, the snoops, the white folk had to register under FMU. Mm -hmm. But the boys sat down and they told them, you are registering under FMU, but some of us, these cars, are not mandated to be under FMU. True. They are our own cars. Because if we shall organize events that are, oh, oh, I would do my own car, and I cause a problem, but it won't be FMU to uh, settle the issues. Yes. Because I Speed limit. Been affiliated to exactly. Now, when in the beginning the posters came out, the posters had two clubs, Enduro, you must mm. And when they decided they are going to do it as individuals, we it's wrote right. to the clubs, okay, that this event is unsanctioned. Era, don't be part of this event. It was their job to write back to us and say we have distanced ourselves from these individuals. No, uh, to cut you short, hmm. they produced two posters. If you look critical, uh -huh. the first one you haven't understood. Mm. You're going before me now. Let me explain to you. Mm. When I write to you and I tell you that the clubs cannot be part of this event, exactly. okay? I think the GS wrote to them, mm. and it is being done by individuals, but it is not blessed or sanctioned by FMU. We could have stopped that event if we wanted, mm. but we did not. Why not? We didn't want to take our dirty clothes out there for everyone to see our problems. Exactly. It would look very bad when you start writing to Ministry of Works, Ministry of, I mean, the police, stopping, yeah. all these people stopping what? An event. We said, we are not part of this event, okay? At the end of the day, it was the clubs who were supposed to write back to us that we have got your communication and we are not part of this event. Then, if they went in the video, then why do you uh, suspect? Because I understand Jeff Kawagambe and the VP uh, for us saw what was coming. That's why they wrote the resignations in time. No, why now we are they, coming why, to then, that. Why did they suspend it? Now you see, you're, you're, you're misleading your viewers here. No, you're no, deciding no, what is going on now. No. You're here to ask me. Uh, Let me tell you what happened. Mm. You understand? Why did Jeff and Shemi resign. resign? I think that's your question. Yeah, because for us, we all knew. Because those no, that is the, also that, that the African question. Yes, but that, 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 that version is what you know. And that actually even our viewers, most people will... So now you are asking me, can I clear the air? Clear the air. Okay. You are here, you're, you've already... It's like you've taken a decision to believe what that's you are to believe. That's why we came here to ask... To the name. Listen to me. These guys were going to be paraded in the AGM. Exactly. And the AGM. Because when we took a decision as XCOM on these other individuals who took part, mm. Omani Ba management, they are not within our jurisdiction. Mm. Management came through elections. Mm. They didn't come. They are not appointed. Exactly. So who do you take them back to? The General Assembly, which we elected them. You understand? And they knew they were going to be presented there. Mm. Cut the embarrassment of being presented in the AGM. Mm. And maybe even a possibility where the AGM says, ah, ah suspend. That, that embarrassment, mm. people could not face. face. So they thought, let us resign, mm. okay? And maybe they will not present our issues in the AGM. Mm. But when you commit a crime and tomorrow you become a safety, does that crime go away from you? It doesn't. So it has to be presented because you committed the crime when you were still in your VP docket so and DVP. So which crime did they commit? Taking part in an unsanctioned event. But you yourself, you told me they, they reached an extent of making the event individual. But so it means by that time, now he wasn't, are you, the, VP, are you, he wasn't the VP. They were. No, uh, listen to me. <laughs> Guys, <laughs> now <laughs> you're misleading no, everyone. No, I'm not misleading you. Listen, they, did, they went that. for Africa Kwetu. Mm. When they are still in their positions, and the DVP, vice president, president? Yes. yes. But you have to understand one thing. There is the XCOM, which mm. are the 15 presidents. Exactly. But then there is you, me, him, and him, who are members of management. We 
there are those who are supposed to uphold that constitution and not make sure make sure we don't violate it. And we are the ones to police the ones who are violating that constitution. But when a whole vice president goes out there eh, and undermines a decision of no, an ex -com. Mr. President, you yourself, you said, you wrote to them. Mm. They didn't write back. Meaning, if they didn't write back, because it reached an extent, audios were saturating. The them, ex -com Them is telling that it was individual. This ex -com, event wasn't under FME. ex -com is the supreme... When, when there's no general assembly, their representatives mm. are the ex -com, the 15 presidents. Exactly. And when they take a decision mm. and say, Dipu, you are not going to take this interview with Chimeza Chamoto Sport, mm. I have to respect that. Exactly. Because at the end of the day, so, there are 15 clubs, they are the ones who comprise FMU. Okay? And we are answerable to them. Exactly. And if they say, don't go to Sejere's show, don't so go to it means the 15 FM, president of all clubs they sat decided, down, they decided and said, this event should, is not, not, should not happen. So for and them, they, you who are part of the management and XCOM, mm. you shouldn't take part in it. What I know that event, uh, uh, some rally drivers participated, but, but they, they weren't suspended. Now, for us, okay, mm. we picked up what we picked up on social media, exactly. pictures and things, whatever we could pick up. Exactly. We don't know. Some were even caught crossfire. Mm. Okay? I'm going to come out on record and say this. Mm. A poor guy like Jonas, mm. he happened to be in the wrong place at the wrong time. Exactly. And the, the event passed near his village. He went to greet his friends. Somebody took pictures. Mm. We said he was part of the event. Mm. And Musoke. But, okay. but Jonas was not suspended. I he was. He, is he going to drive you? No. Ginger? No. He was also no. suspended. He, we he Andy Musoke, now you see you are hearing. You are not into the no, horse's mouth here. Exactly. No, for, don't actually, hear. Mm. I'm here. Ask me. I'm asking. Actually, for more time. Andy Musoke yes. is another one, poor guy. Mm. For him, he went to offer his services of repairing those cars if they got spoiled. As mm. a service provider, not as a competitor. Mm. It is afterwards we found out mm. that this poor guy was what? Caught in the crossfire. Okay? So, now, so when we create Jonas the... Kassim is suspended for this year. Yes, but, but, but can when them, as a driver? they can appeal. What you don't understand, mm. XCOM can take a decision. Mm, but, but there is a national appeals court which mm. can clear, uh, clear you. Exactly. XCOM, if we have made a mistake, they can say, mm. our Mugude step, you made a mistake, mm. this one shouldn't have been suspended, mm. we are releasing him. And we cannot complain. Mm. Do you understand? I understand. So, when you people say that, you know, this man, these people didn't take part, well, they went as individuals, did they go back to the Federation to continue so. their duties? They did so. So, who is supposed to uphold the Constitution? It is us. The, 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 the Fiction presence under yes. the President. Yes. Actually, it, the clubs. And also us as management. Yeah. Because we are the ones who do the day-to-day -day running of the sport. Exactly. Okay? And then we report to the ex from whatever so we have come out with. The people who were suspended didn't fall on organizing no, the, uh, on no. organizing the events. Because if you if you, if all the clubs vote and say an uh, no event, we shouldn't go for it. We are not blessing it. It is not sanctioned. Okay. Now, Mr. Dipu, I want to go much more on the events that are going to happen this year, more especially the part of Africa. Mm. Uh, we have actually, I'm, I'm going to talk about two events and we close the show. We have the Pearl of Africa and WRC. Uh, I understand FMU has promised. Let me okay, first talk about the WRC, then I'll go to the Pearl of Africa. Mm. It will close our show. I understand in uh, Dusmani's term of office, one of our friends uh, in Kenya promised us 50 buses. I heard about it also. You heard. It's yeah. not yet on table. Uh, no. I understand it is now three months to the event WRC because we are going for WRC in the six months. That is May. Yeah. Uh, for WRC. June. I mean I June. After, uh, actually, after Paris. Well, then, well, we are anxious for the event. Some of us went last time, but it was under pressure. You know, we had to clear up. You uh, had uh, COVID, COVID and, and stuff. Yes. The economy was not open. You know. Now. And in, in uh, actually in the whole world, Uganda is ranked as the second yeah, in supporting in, uh, in supporting of the best fans in best Africa. Fans. Yes. So I'm expecting a lot of a lot. Now from let me tell Uganda's you something. Fans. I don't know about. I heard about the offer, mm. but I was not in that time. 
when I came on board, people were talk, talking about uh, what? An offer of 50 buses, I think, from Rai. From Rai. Okay. Mm. This is something I also had. But okay. last year there was a WRC. Fans went to watch that event. Okay. And I did not see anything from them where they were, what? Any offer from Rai on that, on the buses. So I can't talk for what happened in the past. Okay. Let's so can't you, can't, you, can't you contact with them? I can find out, but the problem is I don't know who... We don't have anything on paper. Let me tell you, when we came on board, we didn't even get a single file mm. of what was discussed in the so previous... Most, most right now, we are, the ones who are, mm. we are the ones who are preparing letters files and filing them, mm. so that whoever comes after us will find big, big files like this we hand over to them. Now let's talk about the part. Part, part of Africa, what I understand, mm. it goes upon most of the African countries that do motorsport. Yes. But in most cases, we receive few drivers from African countries. Why? And that's the question I want to ask you. <laughs> you when, because in most cases, no. we might receive one driver from Kenya. You see, let me tell you one oh, thing. We have never received, actually, I've never seen a driver from Rwanda. Rwanda, we have also had a border close. Now it's open. No, before even the border closed. Now that I don't know. I wasn't there. That's why. Uh, uh, now, me, I want you to ask country. you. Mm. Pearl is usually in August. Mm. By then, some like the, the championship is almost decided. Mm. Why do they need to come to Uganda? Just asking. Was, no, so, mm. we fought very hard mm. to see that this year, Pearl is in May. Mm. Not August. So, do you expect drivers? Yes, because Kenya, the championship Rwanda, is still. Yes. It's championship number three in the mm. ARC, mm. round three. Exactly. It's still open. Many mm. people will have to drive in Uganda mm. if they want to win that. What? ARC. ARC. You get it? So we expect the likes of Onkarai, the likes of... Uh, uh, we hope. We hope. Now, you asked me something about uh, Vivo. Mm. For me, when I went to meet with Vivo, I sat down with them the first time. I told them, what you are offering motorsport. Mm. Very little. Mm. And you want a good event. Exactly. You cannot run an event with 110 million shillings, of which exactly. most of that is what product. Mm. We sat down with them. If we had agreed to do it last year, mm. th that offer had gone to 180, exactly. which is still not enough. Mm. But during COVID, if somebody comes out mm. with 180, but mm. again, that time the offer was a lot of it in product mm. and very little in what? Cash. Cash. We did not uh, sign anything. Mm. Again, we have met them. We mm. are hoping that maybe they will look at. But and we are also are, looking when, at bringing it somebody are, else. When you go to Vivo, you also think about us, the media. Because we you see, suffer a lot going to the routes, no, I understand. these cameras, I understand. transport, those things. And we want to bring sport But to you them. see, media mm. also now need to work with us. Mm. Okay? One thing... No, is, as far as I know, me, I'm going to the say, FMU elected media, we have... Uh, Serugo, you Serugo, have, uh, have, have uh, uh, Rob Stiles, Rob Stiles, and we have this Aaron. one, uh, Aaron Isamba. Mm. Then we also have people I know that I, I, I are benefiting from my family. No, they're not the likes like of Boaz, the likes no, of no, 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 no. Uh, these guys. Mutawe, innocent. No, innocent is part of the commission. Mm. You see, our commission has five people. It is mm. the GS, mm. Irene, then four people under her. The four mm. are. Innocent for photography, mm. Rob Styles, yeah. Frank Serugo, and um, yeah, those are the three, and Aaron. 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 Those Aaron. are the five in that mm. commission. So obviously they are part of us. Mm. But one thing about media mm. that we need to understand, mm. taking out the right message and mm. getting like you've come to me today, mm. we have had a very open discussion. Mm. Okay? Mm. And you have heard from my mouth what mm. has been happening. Mm. What you take out to the public is a collective responsibility. Mm. I'm one of the most approachable people you can get around. Exactly. He, you know, people will tell you that when they call me, if I don't pick your call within 10 minutes, I will always what? call, call you back. back. I'm not one of these people who think that ah, I'm a president. I don't even want that title. <laughs> I don't but want that title. To call you. Yes, Mr. Dipu. That's <laughs> it, because titles are earned. Yes. They are so not taken. Exactly. In the past, we have abused our titles. Exactly. When I'm leaving, I will come to all of you and ask you, do I deserve a title now? Mm -hmm. Mujak Salah, yes or oh, no? no? 
If you say no, I'll say, okay, I tried my best. Yeah. If you feel I deserve it, we'll you'll give me my title then. But right now, I'm not here for titles. I'm not here for these benefits. Simani going so for expect, FIA conferences. We expect, we expect what, what? a lot from the Pearl of Africa this year. Pearl of Africa, I can tell you it, one thing. Before even I leave, there was a, 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 a little internet that was passing through about the Pearl of Africa. We're having stages in Iganga, we're having stages ah, in Rubasi. Ah, that is... <laughs> don't, don't so we looked at transport no, from Iganga to Rugazi. No, no. to Iganga. Iganga is another rally, the mm. Ginger Rally, mm. which is going to take place in uh, March. Exactly. Lugazi. It's the part of Africa. And we are not going to these out, outgrowers of Kayunga. Uh, we are going deep down. In that main plantation where Dipu used to rally with mm. Karim Irji, with Jimmy Dean, with all those people. This Lugazi sugar works here. And we are also going to go to Kasakuti plantation. Kayunga Road. Ah, ah. Kasaku, Kasaku that tea plantation after Lugazi before well, you I, come I, to Jinja. Before you come to Jinja. After okay. before Mabida. Yes. I, I All that mm. is part of the pearl. Okay. For once we are getting a road which is going to be totally closed off. Okay. Okay. And the new designing, the team I've I've appointed, I chose only two people. I told them choose your people. Mm. I chose a veteran called David Mayanja. Mm. I told him, Mr. David Mayanja. He used to be Karim's navigator. Mm. He's one of the best people I know, technically. And you have seen him in Electoral Commission okay, also. I've seen him. I told him this is your event, run it. Run it. I'm not giving you people to work with because so the ginger ale is going to be in Uganda. That's in Uganda. Yeah, so okay, so don't the two are different events. Okay. Pearl is going to be a clover leaf design. That means one section here, one section here, one section here, mm. repeated. We are going to make sure that fans don't run from one section to another. another because cars are going to pass three or four times mm. why do you want to move okay you understand and in yes. that place in the spectator stages tugenda kuteka ku muchomo we are going to put beers and sodas you can buy so we are going so you don't have a reason so for the for for you don't have a reason to go from one section to another okay and then we are going to try and see that we have an fmu app okay ready by then so yeah. that when you want to look at live results, you see Chikankane passed here second, mm. but now Sebuguz is number that one. Up. We had that up. Okay. The one the, where trackers will we, yes. send us links, we look at the yes. cars on the So for us, what system. we want, but is we uh, don't want. That app also failed. No, we will now revive it. Mm. It's in the process, but we mm. also want to make sure is that. It go, is, is it going to be uh, a video or is it going to be dotted? Like a navigation app. A navigation app. Oh, okay. But it will be giving you live results as they are happening. It. Okay? Mm -hmm. So at the end of the day, why will you run from one section to another? If I've, if food is there, drinks are there, that's the thing that takes exactly. fans See away. To nonye chakulia, to nonye chakunya, you know? This is what takes us away from our viewing points. And that will help us with safety. Mm. But I also want to ask you, the fans, to help us police yourselves. No, what I know about rally, rally fans, you cannot police a rally fan that is drunk. There True, but you see, there are, are people they listen to. Mm. If you come in a group of 15 people, so you should govern yourselves. You govern yourselves because at the end of the day, safety is a collective responsibility. Exactly. All of us. Because it will look awkward, they have come finally. And, and it, remember, we, we have two yellow cards on our heads exactly. because of safety. Now, the pool, for me, my plans are very different for the sport. Mm. I don't want this Baba's idea attitude anymore. We are trying to sign, uh, we have just signed a deal with NBS. NBS, I saw okay? it. And that's why I was also going. NBS, if you look at it, one, all my competitors will get exposure. Mm. Okay? They are going to be on your TVs all the time. Now, like you, if you're a sponsor and you see somebody like, uh, just, I'm not going to say this badly, just a name like Watendwa. Mm. And you look at him being interviewed, and he tells you these are my challenges. Sina Mpira, mm. Sina Shoka yeah, Zoba, Sina. We also got then you, as a sponsor, you will say, I want to help this man. On the last man. interview we did with Najib, people mm. have been hitting our Facebook page asking for his contact because he said he doesn't have tires. You see? Now, you, they came to you, which is a fantastic thing. You have helped one of my drivers. Mm. Now, imagine if he goes on that forum of NBS mm. where there are 12, nine platforms. How much exposure is he going to get? A lot of exposure. Okay? And this for me is a very big plus plus for me. not me as a federation, but for also my competitors. Exactly. You understand? Yes. Let people know who is Sergeant Lule, who is Watendwa, who is Pasua. 
These are my drivers I care about. People know who Rajiv is. People know Ponziano. People know Duncan. That's why we went down to the river because people know the biggest rivers. Yes. And they have not gone down but to the river. But these poor guys of mine. Yes. So and those are, are my biggest concern. Exactly. You understand? Those understand. are my drivers. And those are my concern. Forget these other guys. Mm. So when we signed this, when we signed this NBS thing, mm. okay, broadcast rights, we get a percentage from them, which is good income will start coming in when some a sponsor says I want to be part of that program. It's fantastic because right now a lot of our footage is being used and sold as DVDs as whatever, our content. our content but we are not getting a single yeah, shilling no so even if me I got one million for an event, it is one million more than what we have been getting, so I'm okay I'm just saying, mm. I don't expect a million I expect more than a million mm. but you know I looked at it that way we have a prudential policy, which is health policy, mm. where we, are, we sell to our fraternity at 110,000 shillings. Mm. In that 110,000 shillings, it covers COVID. That means these things of uh, let's collect money for somebody who has died stops. It stops. Okay? But you allow dependents. Be you have, have two dependents mm. on that, mm. wife and child, okay, at 110,000 a year. If you die, your wife gets 10 million for your funeral. If, God forbid, she dies, you get 5 million. If your child dies, you get 3 million. 30,000 for your inpatient when you are admitted. 5 million for temporary disability, you are on a border border and you fall down mm -hmm. and you have harmed, to, hurt to yourself. The drivers that are registered under FM. Okay? Mm -hmm. But I want, to, I want this to go out to the public. Oh, okay. Now, for every policy we sell, there's a certain percentage that comes back to FMU. 15%, let me be very open, because I'm transparent, I have nothing to hide. Exactly. Why haven't we started it? I don't want people touching cash. You want it, to. it should go on account. Exactly. You understand? So, when you pay the 110, that percentage of prudential goes to them, mm. the balance of our commission goes to FMU account. No handling cash, because it's public money. I don't want tomorrow you people hanging me out there and saying, you have eaten public money, I don't okay. need that one. Okay, dear viewers. So we when we get money, let me finish quickly. When you get money, now that will be income. We will be able to stand on our feet. Exactly. Why can't we help our drivers and clubs? We shall help our drivers because but they need to unite. For each driver that is going to... We, just we can to remove a certain it. amount and say this amount we are putting in the driver's kitty to help them. Then the drivers decide how they want to use it. But the drivers have to unite for that to happen. My preaching is still one thing. Let the drivers unite. They need to unite. Like how we used to be, it is what we want them to do. Okay. Dear, dear, our, dear our viewers, uh, a lot has been said uh, with our president at his residence. You know, he's the current president of FMU, Mr. Dipo. And uh, we're having Bagonga Edward, who says he's late. Uh, um, Yaja Bob, you said Mr. Dipu should talk about the contract of NBS. He has uh, Innocent Mutawe. Uh, you have give, you've given thanks. Uh, Chikozi and Anderson, you have said Kwendi. Okay, these are some of the viewers that are on our Facebook page. As we told you earlier on, we opened up a YouTube page. Uh, we are going to go to your telephones. Uh, we are going to be near your bedroom and anywhere uh thank you for watching it's Chemoto motorsport until next time thank you very much i'm so nice to meet you your timings are like proper ugandan timing the challenge is you know us who are you have to get somebody to work in our kids Problem comes with leaving, you know, even I've just run out. I've told them I have to meet my boss today. I've given you a whole heart open. Interview. Thank you very much. You know, we've never had such interviews. This is our first. But you see, one thing is when you have nothing to hide, I know. I don't have any problem. I know. I, 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 I wish I knew you stay here. I would have this missed. Place. Come and say the hi. How are you, uncle? How are you, how are you doing? How is life? Small home, small man, but I'm happy. I know. Life, that's life.
How is your business? The business is just still doing the phones and stuff. Of course, yeah. nothing much. What else can I do? No, it's it's live. Live. There's nothing. Oh, Are we, we still live? We are still live. You want to talk about about MBS? MBS, What is some comments? So, may I have a little small talk with you? Uh, You have taken a hundred K from each driver mm. with a wedding you took. So there was no income okay. from that side. Usually it is competition license, affiliation fees for clubs, money five hundred K per club. That is not even anything. It is not fifteen money. clubs, seven point five million. We got a small emergency grant. Of, uh, motorcycling, motor rallying, what what. Mm. We tried to clear the clocks which were supposed to have come, which from 2015 we paid off those. So, rent we had almost a year plus without paying without paying rent. We found you, even us in the hey, case. NCS came to us and told us <laughs> we want you out, and we are like, What? Huh? Then they showed us the bill, man, and we said, You mean these people have not been paying you any money? That no, okay. So, so does that government uh, give you any money? Government last year gave us 25 million shillings. That was small money for the big budget. Five, 25 million for motorsport. Imagine, what bad. are we supposed to do with 25 million? That is why safety is very bad. You know, for me, uh, when, I, when I started watching rally, the only problem I could see that we had eh, is safety. Safety is still a challenge, and mm. it's what I even told your friend here in the interview. Safety is a collective responsibility. I know. For now. All of us have to take that responsibility. Mm. Us who watch rally, who are used to rally, we know how to safeguard ourselves. Yeah, but you but need the to problem. learn. You see now, like you, Duncan, Mulikuchi mm. Mezacha Motorsport, people mm. know you now. Yes. All right? Mm. And where you are, when you talk to your fellow fans and say, guys, to we are very close to the road, it can mm. be a hazard for them or I for know. us. Mm. Please move behind. You, they will listen to. No, just saying. Us, eh? We need to police ourselves. No, for us, eh? mm. like for us, people can, people can understand. People who are in the rally fraternity, mm. for example, those who come from Kampala, mm. they know what to do to safeguard themselves. Mm. That's why you've never seen anyone who who is coming from Kampala and is in Gulu, whether whether, whether he's in uh, Kabale that has got an accident. Mm. The challenge comes with the people who we find in the villages. Mm. You get but you it? see, that's mm. why before an event, these people who go around the road mm. are supposed to sensitize the villagers. I know. Okay, and tell them when cars are coming, keep your animals away, keep yourselves away, try and stay far away from the road as possible, mm. keep your children away. These are things you need to sensitize them. But for us always, when you see the, the, the they are, what are they called? Obulango. Yeah. They are They are adverts. Mm -hmm. eh? They only they, they know my talk. Oh, Lukari, Ramoto Sporty, mm. uh, you wait for Chikankane, you wait for who? Ah, then after they talk about the money, but they don't sensitize about them. But you keep your animals, but don't ride your border borders. Eh? What did you expect from that club? Those things. Eh? That, that club, that event, <laughs> not done. <laughs> them for them, they were more interested in their gate collection. They were uh, not bothered about. Everybody is looking about money. Yes. Okay. Even yes. me, as me, Duncan, I'm looking at money. Yeah, but you see, do you compromise people's safety? No. no. Was there zero car, car zero, zero zero or zero zero zero? No. Or a sweeper in Barara? I never saw them. Drivers at first section of day two mm. had refused to open the road because there was no uh, route opener there. They used police car. And in eight kilometers, Arthur had caught up with the police car. <laughs> so what kind of safety anyway, let's, are we promoting? Let's okay? just think that we had gone to sleep. Mm. Now we are coming back to normal. So when we are trying to do what we are trying to do, mm. 
people need to support and understand what we are trying to do. I understand. We are trying to do it not for depot. Mm. I'm trying to lay you structures and a foundation so that whoever comes in after me does not find the same problems and he takes the spot further. Okay. You understand? For me, I came one term, but mm. my job was to clean. Okay. And that is what you I only did. come for one term? One term. Are you serious? Clean up. That is all I So should I do. come for, uh, for the second term? Why not? Will you support me? Well, I'm there. I mean, for me, <laughs> mine is one vote. There are 87, <laughs> 70, 80, 90. <laughs> in the assembly so you hey. need to convince everybody there okay but i want to thank you for the good no. work we are thank trying and one thing i was even telling number 32 there yeah. we need to take out you see when you depend on rumors mm. then you have already taken a side i know have you ever tried he has called me how many times do i ever respond fail to respond to your calls uh, if i don't pick up within five ten minutes i'll call him back Yes. I'm very approachable. Yes. I'm not one of these, uh, I don't talk to people, they shouldn't call me, I'm president. No. This is what these things are for. No. <laughs> you guys, for me, I'm a third generation. I know. My father was born in Uganda, my grandfather was born in Uganda, I'm born here. My wife is a Ugandan. I know. I've even heard him speaking Luganda. I thought that she doesn't know Luganda, but was oh, he, we are here sometimes. She speaks then, Lusoga, Uganda. <laughs> Her, I you know, know her very much. So I that's why I'm saying, for me, <laughs> I, I don't treat me like these Mwindis who have come here just yesterday. Okay. No, most of my friends are Ugandan, indigenous Ugandans, not Mwindis. Born and raised them. here. Yes. Yes. I was here during Amin's time. When he was being chased out, I was in Uganda. <laughs> and you're here telling me what that bringing color really is the wrong way. <laughs> no, that, by the way, I was me, here when Amin was chased out. Binaisa came in, no, Simani Lule came in, mm. Lule left, Binaisa came in, Army Council came in, I was here. For me, for me, Road. For me I know, you know some of, our, some of our people will won't accept. But for me on my side, I would appreciate the good work you're doing for FMU. Let me tell but, you guys, if you're going to put a mall here, mm. there will be squatters. When you're removing the squatters, they're not going to say good things about you. I know, I know. You understand? But yeah. the mall has to be put. I know. And the mall is the future of motorsport. But for us, you have already stood behind you from the and start. trust me, for me, I'm not here <laughs> to make a name or to make money. Yes. There is nothing in FMU. I know. If anything, FMU I've put in and I've invested so much of my own money. I know. But I'm not interested in that. For me, I know that I gave 15 years of my life to motorsport. Yes. Where I left it is not where it is. We should have been very far. I know. Okay? Every other person who came in went after me, when we left, should have taken this spot where we are now taking it today. Yeah. You think Kenya would have been ahead of us? We have more entries than Kenyans there. Yeah. But we should be further. So when me, I'm there, Funga, Nati, Nati, yeah. Nati, 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 where they're eating from, they're going and resigning, resigning from their positions. <laughs> because I'm here asking them, mm. you people, this spot is bleeding. The little that is there, you want to take that also. How will this sport survive? I know. So when you close these nuts and you start questioning every small detail, where did that money go? How much did you pay for that thing? You bought a bunch of bananas for 10k, I can get them in Kansanga for 3k. Why did you spend so much money? You know, and I want accountability. That's why everybody will resign. And we have chiefdoms. Everybody has, has created a chief. My friend 32 can't work with you. Hmm? Mm, I know. No, I'm just saying. You, our biggest problem in the sport is we have created chiefdom. Jeff had his own chiefdom. Mm. He had these few people. If you're close to him, you'll be put in officials. Mm. You'll go for trainings. You'll be promoted. Yes. If you're not close to him, you'll never get a chance. I know. So you go for safety training, but you are not deployed. What are you going to feel? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. That is very for bad. me. I'm for building capacity. Yeah. My job is to see that Duncan has done training. Why aren't you using him? Why is he sitting on the sidelines? Okay? Yeah. He has done stewards training. Why aren't you using him and putting him as a steward? Make him a steward in a small event and let him shine so that people can see that this is his potential. Let him show what he knows. Duncan, present at closing remarks too. Okay. Mm -hmm. You can give us your closing remarks and then you close our chapter for today. I want to say thank you to Chimeza Cha Motorsport. Guys, thank you so much for coming to my home. Um, 
Motorsport is a sport we all love. Safety is a collective responsibility of all of us. I'm still going to insist that, you know, uh, we need to keep safe. We need to make sure that all the events we have going forward, we have a lot of eyes on us from people like FIA who are watching and picking up videos on social media. And they are seeing, you know, they want to see us implement a lot of the things they have taught us. So even safety, we want to come out and ask you, the viewers, the fans, to help us in, you know, let's govern ourselves and police ourselves collectively. It's very important. The sport, again, like I said in uh, my earlier remarks there, that the sport, I'm very approachable. If anybody has any queries, don't listen to rumors, call me and I'll clear, you, I'll clear the air and tell you exactly what's happening in the sport. So one thing about me is I'm very transparent, I'm very open, a bit too open. People complain that I say things as they are, but I'm very approachable also at the same time. And I want the best for the sport. To all the fans, to all the viewers, to the motorsport fraternity, I thank you all. I love you guys. God bless you all. Kakati, tuagalo kwa zamu na mwenye na baadhi kuprogramu ya fechi mweza cha motorsport. Tuwa deno muro di polo paralia, tuagalo kwa mwa zoko bantu asodde, o kutuchi. Mpa kuhuko. Tuagalo kwa zoko bantu asodde. Hey, na tuwa kuhuko kwa na gama. Mweza kwa Motorsport what you were ever nigh to a Gorkoza Munava Jiriko. We never have a longer two tambos in Tuchino, to a Gorkoza Mukum Stako camera, Anderson, a Tamsa Shomida Gundi Zafe, to a Gorkoza Mwena, 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 and to a fair about Tamla for Mizaja Motorsport. Let's keep the fire burning. Motorsport has to be on top. Quagalabotayagala, to Jaji to Sayo. Thank you, thank you very much. You see, one thing is, 